and welcome to flaming summer. <laughs> uh, it's the 9th of July 2011 and it's about 27 in the morning. Best time of the day. Anyway, uh, I sort of love this country despite its numerous and multiple faults. And the echo's gone up to 60p. Uh, it's a Saturday emergency beano. And although the German beers, actually they were really good because they weren't all Pilsners. You think German, you think lager. Well, they were lager in the sense that they were bottom fermented, but oh, they were, especially the Spandau stuff, they were solid brews. Uh, especially the special beer, special brow. So, today, uh, I fancy whipped cream on top of a large cappuccino. Whoop! And it's raining on my camera. And then maybe, maybe a couple of things to drink. And an episode of Twit. And no agenda. And Windows Weekly. Basically, same as usual. Oh, member of Google Plus. And I got invites. Anyone wants to be, let me know. I think it helps if you got a Google Mail or a Gmail account, but what the hell. And it stopped raining. <laughs> Although it's still, it's still rather so. So, later. Um, large cappuccino, venti cappuccino with whipped cream. Uh, a meal with enhanced chips. And look at the colour of that, lovely red. Except, that's a pint of cranberry juice. And, it's the Ernest Willows. And, it's in Clement outside. Ah, uh, it's coming up. And the, um, the clip came off my uh, panzer clip. I innovated. It's a surreal day today. Uh, did I mention the echo at 60p? I think I did. I need to be with Judas Priest in them. Anyway, this is Giant Stairs. Giant Stairs. White Horse Brewery, 4.6% alcohol by volume. Uh, lovely golden colour. Nice head. And. Don't smell that bad. Semi creamy. Not much body, but. A solid bitter aftertaste, a bit, bit watery actually. And this is number two. Another one with a rather good head. This is Golden Owl by Cottage Brewery. Brewery. Four percent alcohol by volume. A mid golden ale, he says. Okay. Anyway, it's a little crack. Again, light on body. So Slight orange she taste. I think the term is complex. I'm not sure though. I think that's a B as well. I like it, but uh, today could be a uh, day. Hey, the sun's come out. And I've already forgot the name of this beer. Bear with me, viewers. If anyone is actually watching this. I think this Great Western is another cottage brewing by nail. 4.7% alcohol by volume. Not this Western brewery. Uh, so this and the last one, train related. Uh, darker, creamy head. Got the sun out there. It is July. Uh, there's the last one. Mm, this is slightly creamy. Colour body. Again, it's sort of... I don't know. 
complex, citrusy, slightly orangey taste. That's a bee again. This could be a bee day. There's a joke in there somewhere. And the last for today. Practicing for later on this year. Lefe Blonde. Oh, this is a new bottle. Actually, I bought the Lefe from Mr. Liddell in the fridge from about 14,000 years ago. As usual, I've got to be careful with the pouring. And that was rubbish. There's your two exposure kicking in. 6.6% uh, alcohol by volume. The Belgians, well, if it deserves it, it gets it. Wow, that tastes a lot stronger than it is. If you drink Duval, which is considerably stronger, it doesn't taste as strong as that. That's a drinking beer. Actually, that's a sipping beer. 